All right, guys. We're gonna do a little video here on the flow bench. I haven't really gotten much time on this uh, with IDI stuff, anyway. Um, kind of been tinkering around. This isn't really a a stock head or anything like that. It's kind of a um, a hodgepodge of bad and good. Um, it's still better than stock at this point, but uh, um, I found some good stuff that I'm gonna apply to a stock port. Um, and uh, hopefully get some better numbers than this, but sorry, get a little jump over stock. Um, so I just thought I'd show you guys what I'm seeing here with this stuff. Um, but I think the, the ceiling's a little bit higher than what you're gonna see here. So um, anyway, I'll fire it up. Hopefully it's not too loud on the, on the phone here, so. depression 28 inches and uh, the way this stand is made the way, the way I built it based on the PTS stuff is it'll automatically hunt for 28 even when you adjust your valve height thousands of lift
Okay. So that's with the stock intake attached on the most restrictive port on that intake. So um, obviously the intake isn't, isn't a restriction. Even in years past, I kind of thought maybe the pinch point would be a restriction and I've modified intakes to take it out of the mix, but that pinch point flows more than the cylinder head does, even with some mods. So um, this here actually has some deshrouding done with a with a uh, a cutter bit on the um, seat and guide machine. Um, it also has some short turn radius work and uh, a little bit of cleanup on the uh, just below the seat um, with a with a three angle valve job to it. Um, the port work is like voodoo on these things. You you really don't want to touch them. At least at this point, with the filming of this video, you don't really don't want to touch, touch your ports if you don't want to. If you don't have to, it's just you're going to do more damage than, than you are good if you even touch them. So um, right now, where I've seen all the big gains is is right around uh, the seat area um, and the valve. Uh, you know, increasing the margin on the valve helps and, and stuff like that. So I'll get some more videos up when I do some more port work and whatnot. This was just kind of um, you know experiment a little bit here after hours today. So I thought I'd share it anyway. Thanks.